Thank you for joining me. I am Christian Evans and I want you to have a successful day. These are Thursday Thoughts. In today's Thursday Thoughts, I will be talking about what they don't tell you about losing weight. Before we get into the video, this is a reminder for the free t-shirt giveaway. All the details will be down in the description box. What they don't tell you about losing weight or what I didn't figure out about losing weight is how to keep it off. I've lost weight, I've gained weight. Gained weight and I lost weight. I have a recurring cycle with this phenomenon in my weight loss journey. Now, some people are more disciplined than others. Some may not. I may fall in between that depending on what day it is. But what I mean by what they didn't tell me or what they didn't tell us about losing weight is the keeping it off. The weight loss and, and keeping the weight off is by far the toughest part of the weight loss journey. Because once you lose weight, you're like, oh, I can eat anything I want, or at least that's what I was thinking. So instead of generalizing, I'll say what I was thinking. I say, oh, I can eat what I want. I can go back to eating this and eating that, and it won't affect me because I've always, well, I've already lost the weight. That was my thinking. And that's just not the case. You still have to be even more diligent, even more disciplined more than ever before if you don't want to go back to the person you once was in your before picture. When I first dropped my weight, I was very, very happy. Then I decided to eat as a celebration dinner and say, oh, hey, you know what? I lost my weight. Let's celebrate and let's eat. Then the very next day, once I got on the scale, I was very confused on how I gained three pounds. In my thinking, I'm like, this food didn't weigh three pounds, so how did I gain three pounds? And that just sent me on a more educational cycle or investigation to figure out how this happened. Then I started understanding about water retention and body conserving um, all your fluids and, and all that kind of different stuff. So there was a whole different chapter to weight loss when I lost my weight that I was not prepared for. And I'm still learning to this day. Like I said, some people are more disciplined than others. I fall right in between there. I can get disciplined when I feel like it, or that's what everybody says. I can get disciplined if my mind is, is really right, if I'm in, a, if I'm, if I'm in a, a space. Just some days are better than others. That's the only thing I can say. And another thing about what they didn't tell us about weight loss is how many people would ask you questions? Coming under the pressure of answering those questions, coming under the pressure of living up to that picture of weight loss all the time. It is it is tough because at least far as for me, when I lost my weight, I didn't do it for anybody else. I did it for myself. I wasn't looking to start a blog, start this vlog or a YouTube channel, none of that. I just lost weight for myself because as you know in my story, I was high blood pressure, sleep apnea, and I just didn't want to be the fourth person in my family to pass away. That was my only motivation, how that goes as far as for weight loss. So I just wasn't prepared when it comes to living up to the expectations of others and being that person in their picture and just living up to that beacon of hope that you end up giving everybody when you do lose weight. People are looking for all types of motivation and once you lose weight and you have a very good before and after picture that has dramatic results, people are going to want answers. How did you do this? What did you eat? How many calories? How many carbs? How many protein? What is your workout? And it becomes overwhelming. If your heart is right, you will find a way to answer those questions and everything will start to become more natural. But the initial part of it I just wasn't prepared for. So that's just another th thing that I just wasn't prepared for because that's not what they tell you when you lose weight of how many people are going to ask you questions and want to be motivated and that are inspired by your pictures when you lose weight. 
and I just wasn't prepared for a lot of the heartfelt stories from people who could relate to me to people's situations that were slightly worse than mine. And here I am thinking that, you know, I had it bad. You know, some people really, really have it tough and it's, it's an emotional draining situation once you're intaking everything and you want to help them, but sometimes they just may not be in the right type of position at that moment to receive the help. Let me know the things that you went through after you lost weight that you weren't expecting when you started losing weight. Let me know some things that were tough for you. You know, good and bad. I want to start a dialogue with you and just get some feedback from you because I'm always looking to learn from you. One of my many goals in life is to help inspire the world. You can help me achieve this goal by sharing this video. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. I post new videos every Monday and Thursday, 8 a.m. Central Time. Remember, it's each one teach one. Spread love, not war. Speak positivity into your life every day and speak positivity into someone else's life every day. And if you haven't done it already, please subscribe to my blog, ChristiansWeightSuccess.net. Thank you and have a successful day. By the way, don't forget, I will be at the Chicago Fit Expo on Saturday, May 6th. So if you see me, stop by, say hi, we can chat, you know, just chop it up. I am going to enjoy seeing you there. Hello, I'm Christian Evans. I lost nearly 200 pounds without any diet pills or surgery. I feel way better than I did when I was this guy right here. Believe it or not, I'm the same person, but a different mindset. I'm more energetic, I'm more healthier, and I have the best outlook on life than I've ever had in my entire life. I want you to have this same good feeling like I have. I have a program for you, and it's called the Christian's Weight Success Starter Program. Direct message me to learn more.